Hey, she, guess what? Huh? Who are you? You're not Hideki, are you? Nope, but I'm the guy who's gonna review a game starting you. A game? Of me? She does not understand. Some Japanese company called Marvelous Entertainment made a game based on you and Hideki's anime series called Showbiz like 8 years ago. Don't you remember that? Chabits? Me and Hideki? In a video game? That's right, Chi. Oh yeah, I heard of that game. But Chi don't remember well now. It's a game that follows you and Hideki's story through the whole Showbiz series, Chi. Me and a good friend of mine who's a big fan of yours are gonna review this game now. Chi? Oh, I have a big fan? Chi? That's right, and you're helping me too. Hmm, sure sounds like fun. I'll go ask Hideki if he's okay with that. <laughs> Dinox Live, episode 144, season 3, Dinox and Aras tell reviews from Showbiz for the GBA. Okay, so I told Chi to come as well. I wonder who I can call so I can do the review with her. I know, I was still a big Showbiz fan. I'll call her to see if she can help me out with this review. Yes, me. I was wondering if you wanted to help me on a video uh, game review I was planning. It's from your favorite anime series. Are you talking about Chavit? Whoa, uh, how do you guess? Mm. Yeah, actually it is. Well, duh, you said one of my favorite animes and I love Chavit. Yeah, there's a game for the Game Boy Advance, Chobit, um, that I wanted to review and I was wondering, since you're a big fan of it, if you could review the game for with me as well. Plus, you know, I'm having Chi to review the game as well with us. Oh my god, Dinox! Of course I want to, and I am going to get to meet Chi! Okay, that's great. So, you want to do the review with me today? Oh, but of course. I'm on my way right now, Dinox. Another game of you in your house, huh, Dinox? Fine. I'll let it slide this time, cause you're also being Chi's dimension as well when doing this review. This will be fun. <laughs> you came what's up how's everything going thank you thanks for coming jesus wait for for me in the Let's go. Yeah. hello youtube this is dianskum speaking once again and this is Arashtel speaking as well and today we're going to review a game for the game boy advance that only came out in japan sadly and that game is called Chavitz Advance, also known as Atachi Take no Hito, and it came out in 2002, which is developed by Marvelous Entertainment. As being an only Japan title, just like another game I reviewed long ago, Nage Lee, right? If you're lucky enough to be in Japan and as a hardcore Chobits fan, I'm sure you'll be able to get your hands on the limited edition Game Boy Advance Clear Blue. It's a Game Boy Advance bundle with that game. Oh, I wanted that bundle. Too bad I don't live at Japan or I could have imported it at that time. Me too, but I don't regret it. Cause as good as the game may sound, I wouldn't really classify this as a game. He? I thought you said it was a game, Dinos Goon. Why not? Cause the last time I checked, this game runs through the whole Showbiz series. If you have seen the entire Showbiz anime created by Clamp, then you practically know more than 80% of the game already. Regardless of the Japanese text and playing the game for the first time. Oh yeah, now I remember. It's more like an interactive movie than a game. And it's kind of like watching the Chobits anime through the whole story. And everything that happened in the anime itself are explained here. Exactly, but instead of constant animation, you get few animation and still pictures of events that, that happens in the anime in the game. 
Now, let's get started with the actual part of the review. Tia agrees. When you first turn on the game, the first thing you will see is the opening of the game itself. Now, some footage of the actual opening of the enemy and then showing off some of the main characters. Plus, you will also be able to enjoy a 32-bit showbiz music played on your Game Boy Advance. Sounds great for a Game Boy Advance. Yeah, once you start a new game, you will be asked to enter your name. You may enter your name in either Hiragana, Katagana, Kanji, or American Letters. At least they have that last option. And then you'll be taken to the start of the showbiz story. Yeah, if you've seen Chavez and don't struggle reading much the Japanese text, then it will be the same description of the story pretty much. But for those of you who don't know, well, I'll explain this in a simple way so I won't spoil too much of the story. A 19-year-old virgin man called Hideki just moved to a city in Tokyo from a country, trying to go to prep school, to then attend college. As he keeps walking, he checked the persicums that were in cell. He was excited until he noticed it's super expensive, which he couldn't afford at all. But fortunately, he surprisingly found a persicum at the street's dumpster. She, That's... me! Yep, sorry for you to hear this, Chi. Yeah, but I think I remember that he that you took Chi to his home and saved Chi from being wasted. Exactly, and then Hideki tried to wake you up. Little did he know the on button was in the part of the body that you... Yeah, I know. No need to complete that sentence. Anyways, most of this game is based on dialogue text. That people start talking a lot in the series and basically seem endless. And then even the Shabbat fans may wonder, when am I going to play this game? Too much text! Yeah, but if you bought this game expecting it to be a dating sims game, or you'll be able to play a lot during the Showbiz series, then you're screwed because the only time you're actually going to be playing the game is in Simomo Simon Says Exercise, which basically you have to press all the buttons in order to say the exact way Simomo Says it. Yeah, it's decent, but pretty simple after you notice once you play it. You do gain a level if you follow all her correct moves, for more challenging stages of this later. And there are also times when she may ask you a question and you can choose from three options to answer her. Hideki is always honest to she, so if he's honest to she, she will be more happy with him. Yup, and there's also a map as well to go to your next destination of your story. But other than those three and a few other options of gameplay in quotes in this game, there's not really much you can do in this game besides press A every time you want to go to the next group of text dialogues. Yeah, it will get boring already after a while. The graphics are really nice, especially that they are taking out from the actual anime of Chomets, and some animations from clips of the series run pretty decent for a Game Boy Advance. It's pretty much 2D cartoon graphics. Music is pure awesomeness, especially if you're a big fan of this game cause it sure stays true to the music used in the anime. Yes, to conclude Shobit's advance, Atachi Dake no Hito. This game is only recommended to those people who are die-hard fans of this game, even if you hardly know Japanese. If you know the story and a little gameplay this game has, then you should be able to know how to go through around this story no problem. But if you are the type of person who never watched the show, doesn't like this oh. anime, and don't know Japanese, plus can't stand the fact that there is hardly any gameplay at all, this game is not for you, and you'll hate it with a passion and get bored real easily, trust me. Other than that, you may enjoy the game for its story, music, animation, and graphics. Just imagine combining a Game Boy Advance game with a Game Boy Advance car video cartridge to this. You'll get a video that you can kinda play on. You will also hear Chi say Chi as well as you play. And you may find that adorable if you're into cute stuff like that. Well, to sum up this review, I give Showbiz Advance Atachi Daki no Hito a 7 out of 10. <laughs> <laughs>